downtown Las Vegas. Yeah, we're down here and we're gonna do a what baby? It's gonna be a pizza crawl, shootout, yes, throwdown, yes. all of the above. There's some new Vegas pizza places down here. We're gonna go try them. And out. some old classics. Mm -hmm. So uh, we've tried a couple before, but we wanna try them all, all at all in the same couple days, so we get a good comparison. Yes, we're definitely revisiting the old ones that we know of that everybody's heard about and see if it's like oh we've always looked for consistency so it'd be consistent and right. if it's still just as yum as we remember that's right and underneath the fremont experience is the first place we're going to go is called 322 pizza it's a new one new one you ready ready let's try it out Bar. We're here. We're gonna try the simple cheese. Plain cheese. We're gonna we're gonna wear plain cheese at all. Of them. all of them. Yeah. So here we go. It's nice and warm. Mm -hmm. It has a garlic hint to it. So if you like garlic, this is the pizza for you. Uh, how much was it? This is four ninety five before tax. All right. First impressions is uh, the crust is a little bit. Floppy. As you see, without folding it, it kind of flops out. But yeah, what is going for a taste? It's cheese really doesn't stretch. The sauce is okay. Um, this one in there gets me, it's a little bit floppy. But it kind of reminds me of a um, a very good frozen pizza. That's that's the kind of taste I get from it. Cheesy frozen pizza. Yeah, yeah, very cheesy. A little bit crunchy and crispy on the crust, but it's good. It's okay. Not bad. But really, I'm looking forward to trying the other spots out. We made it to pizza spot number two. At the El Cortez, it is mm -hmm. called Make It City Pizza. Yes, inside. Yeah, inside the Cortez. Yep. So we're gonna try it out. Right behind us. Yep. We are comparing only cheese pizzas. These, this place here, the Naked City Pizza, has only square pizzas, but it's humongous. Yeah, square pie. It's a really big slice. We got a corner. Uh -huh, and a corner, and it's three fifty for this one. Yeah, before it's tax. Super hot. I can oh, barely be care. Yeah. Oh. Really good. The crust is thicker. Oh yeah. Huh, Chicago y very crunchy. The sauce is very light. Let's try the cheese part. It's a good sliced cheese pizza. On me, it's a little plain, but it's a good cheese pizza. Maybe it needs a little bit of Parmesan or something. Yeah, uh, just like you said, it's definitely on the thicker side. Uh, could be Detroit style or Chicago, I don't know. We haven't been to Detroit yet, so. <laughs> but uh, here we go, the cheese section. Mm -hmm. To me, it tastes similar to last night's 320 pizza and bar. Almost the same kind of sauce and uh, cheese. Uh, you know, it's definitely reheated, but uh, it made it a little bit crisp, which is nice. I mean, for three fifty, for this big old piece, can be that. This is a good deal. But yeah, pretty good. Spot number three. Evil pie. Evil pie. Hey. So uh, this is right next to the end of the Fremont experience. And I think this is the one that's more known, huh, baby? It is, yeah. it is. Uh, yeah. We kind of went from the first two were not so well known, now we're stepping it up to the more more known pizza yeah. places. So we're gonna go in, get a slice of cheese, and I think they got a promotion here. They do. Yeah. A slice and a beer for six bucks. Yeah, that's not bad, so we're gonna do that. Mm -hmm. 
First thing uh, I noticed, super thin, really hot. Come close up on this cheese, this little burnt cheese that they have on the edge. You can tell, it's gonna be really crispy. And little pools of uh, cheese oil on it too. You can almost know that it's gonna be a good bite. Right off the bat. Much better than the other two. Um, cheese has good flavor. Pizza sauce. Uh, just the right amount of tartness too. And uh, I really love the, the thin crust. Even the edge, look at that. Wow, right in the area. This is a good one. Good job, Eagle Pie. The crust is very good, yeah. as you said. Good. Cook on that crust. This cheese is perfect. It's a really well tasting cheese. Now, the other ones needed a little flavor. This one doesn't need anything. It's very good. Come to Vegas downtown. Come to Evil Pie. This is the one you gotta get. For our last and final number four pizza spot. Maybe we'll see. Yeah, well, so far this is gonna be the last one. It's gonna be Pizza Rock. Yeah, yeah. And we're here. It's awesome. We've been here before, and as I remember, it was pretty good pizza. It was pretty good. So in fact, check it out. Yeah, many have said, even in reviews, that this is probably the best pizza place in downtown Vegas. Yeah, we're gonna see. Yeah. yeah, if it's true, if it's true, I know the last time we were here and we checked out this pizza place, it's pretty good pizza, and we really thought it was the best in downtown. So we'll see if it still rains. Yeah, see if Supreme. it's consistent, right? Yeah. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Here we go. Really that's, floppy. That's a, yeah, that's a major pop there. Not too toasted on the bottom. Yeah. Let's try this out. Kind of like stinky. You say stinky? Snaky. Oh. Mmm. <laughs> Good cheese. Yeah. Good crust. I mean, it is a little floppy. Yeah. yeah. Good cheese. Pizza rock. Good. Pizza rock and evil pie right now. How's the, uh, the, the sauce? The sauce is sauce perfect. It's actually very lightly sauced. Mm. Not very heavily sauced at all. Yeah, uh, the guy very, was... Hmm? Well, he was nice enough to cut two pieces yeah. out of the single slice. Yeah, so. and it's very cheesy. Yeah. And, and it's um, five bucks. Five bucks a slice. Jack, you see what you mean? Uh, definitely has a major flop on But I could tell just by touching the uh, crust, it is crunchy and... Airy, is a squeeze it. But here we go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can tell the cheese is very flavorful. It's almost like they already sprinkled like Parmesan or something on top of it. The sauce is not not too tangy. Perfect ratio of sauce. Like it's not too sauced up. The cheese is just the right amount. Go for the crust. Uh -huh. Got the same kind of crunch as the Evil Pie. Boom. I'm gonna have to take several more bites to uh, make up my, my decision. That's a wrap up for our pizza crawl. Yep, the verdict Throw is- Throw down, shoot out. Shoot out. All that shoot stuff, out. yeah. So what was your favorite? My favorite was Evil Pie. 
you can tell they really care for that pizza it's perfectly cooked the cheese was yum it was it was like tasty it was so good the little crispness because they burned it a little bit on the edges it was like the best so for me it's evil pie then it was pizza rock pizza rock was a very good pizza um it tasted a little rushed though but it was still a very good pizza then for me 322 which is right on the fremont street experience and uh the one that's in the cortez uh, uh, naked city. city that one that one is like definitely on the bottom i know naked city it, it was very good it was the square one um, it, it gets you really full so for 350 it's a, it's a good deal definitely and the other one just felt so like plain yeah i, I like costco pizza better than those two so yours baby i i would have to mirror the exact choices for the choice for the reasons that, that she gave mm -hmm. uh, yeah uh, evil pie first awesome slice of mm -hmm. cheese pizza um, uh, evil i mean uh, uh, pizza rock uh, i think it could have been as good if they just put it in the oven to crisp at the bottom just mm -hmm. a little bit more it was it was just uh, just like just like you said it was a little mm -hmm. bit rushed you know um, for third place uh, uh, naked city you can't beat it 350 thick square mm -hmm. slice you'll get full guaranteed mm -hmm. for that yeah and the last one is uh, 322 yeah it, it was just a slice and serve yep no no extra heating yeah. uh the mozzarella tasted like some bulk frozen mozzarella they just sprinkled over kind of tasteless yeah right? very true so these pizzas we got them by design so we didn't ask him That's to right. twist them up anymore or anything yeah, like that right. but you can tell that even evil pie the guy cared a lot more for his he, pizza he, sh he definitely yeah. did definitely did yeah. well that's a wrap up uh thanks for watching our uh downtown las vegas pizza shootout and we'll catch you guys on the next one.